<laughs> really? Yeah. You did what? Yeah, yeah, yeah we in the dining room. Just had an you took room. Yeah. yeah. We were agging each other out. And then it got to the point where I was getting so agged out that I shouted and he shouted Over what? Everything. We genuinely just had an argument in the dining room with, with each other. Really? Yeah. Actually? Yeah. Very much. Actually. What? Very much. Everything. He said, how would you feel if, how, what would you spend a £76 pound shopping budget on? And he said, I'm a non-smoker, so I wouldn't buy it on fags, I wouldn't buy it on me. Him. Oh, we don't want to leave on Friday, but if we do leave on Friday, we can make dinner. Then I started going on about something. Then Joe went, answer the man. I went, I've answered his question. And then Joe was just like, no, you ain't. And then I said, on the silver lining, though, if I did have to leave on Friday, I went, I'd get a McDonald's. Then he went, but we don't want to leave. And I said to him, all you talk about is leaving. I went, do you actually want to stay any longer? And he went, you know I want to stay. He went, but we might not. I was like, well, stop thinking negatively. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I went, I have my own mind. I know what I'm thinking. Then he was just like, yeah, but we don't want to leave. I was like, Joe, I know that. I've said this several times. Then we just kicked off at each other. And then the man said sarcastically, as always, it's been, as he went, as always, it's a pleasure to talk to you. Then the man went, as ever, it's a pleasure to talk to you, boys. Low tone, <laughs> chef. Well, he kept on saying it. Then he kept on going, then he kept on going, what are you saying? What are you saying? I went, you're not saying nothing because you keep on repeating yourself. He's just me off in general. It was a car, say, bicker. Was that? Bit of an upgrade. Because he doesn't shut up. All he talks about is leaving. We, we generally said we were both just agged out tonight. Mm. It's just one well, of those nights. Where he's been long night. And I said to him, well, you need to stop thinking about it as much. I went, at the end of the day, it's, it's not what might actually happen. And I went, the public are going to be watching you saying all this and thinking, well, why, is, why do we want to keep him in the process if all he's going to do is moan about it? I but I spoke to Shane from Westlife, so I can't complain.